Hello and welcome to this weekend edition of the Daily Dose of Greek. This is Rob Plummer and I want to highlight for you this weekend, Memrise. You'll notice up here at the upper left of your screen, it says M-E-M-R-I-S-E. You can see the, the webpage, Memrise.com. Memrise.com. And so if we log in here, we click on login, and you will have a different login. For me, login is free, but uh, I've been playing around with this, just experimenting with it a little bit. And there's all kinds of uh, great ways to learn vocabulary uh, for the Greek New Testament. And I have a former student who created three sets of flashcards here, and this is coming up for the Philippians course that I'm offering through Adela Media. So just know these these flashcards are available for anyone, and they'll be uh, listed in the um, in the section underneath the video. But in the course, I, these will be there. I assume students will be using these to learn the vocabulary of Philippians. So one of one of the list here, um, this this course right here, is just every word in Philippians, <laughs> right? And then one of them right here down here with the BNTG that stands for Beginning New Testament Greek assumes that a student has learned. Now, the 330 or so words in that beginning grammar, so words that occur 50 times or more. And so this course only quizzes you on those words that, uh, that, that are not from the beginning grammar, words that you would not have learned in a beginning grammar. Uh, then this course here is words in Philippians that are not in beginning New Testament Greek are going deeper New Testament Greek. And the going deeper New Testament Greek grammar goes down to 15 occurrences. So this tests students uh, on vocabulary that is 15 occurrences or less. I've been playing around with it a little bit, just poking around, seeing what happens when you do this or that. I'm very impressed with the way the program works. Uh, the way the Memrise program works, just the way it repeats things, and if you, you miss them, the way it brings them back, and it presents it from several different angles. Again, it's free. It's all Memrise. All this is free. Um, you do have to pay by watching ads. There, as I was poking around with it, I thought, you know, it might be worth it not to see these ads again to pay a little bit. Um, I will point out to you, if you go to uh, the website beginninggreek.com, beginninggreek.com and you scroll down to the free resources look here's Im memorize vocabulary flashcards specifically cued uh, to the beginning greek grammar you can see not only is there the free memorize flashcards but there's free anki flashcards free quizlet flashcards but since we're talking about memorize i'll just point those out if you get on memorize and you want to download that also if you go to deepergreek.com deepergreek.com there is a memorize flashcard set as well cued specifically to, to that grammar. And again, that that's, takes vocabulary down to 15 occurrences or more. The beginning grammar is 50 occurrences or more. You can see as well, there's free Anki and free Quizlet flashcards here. While we're here, I'll just point out tons of free resources queued to these grammars. I didn't, this was not my purpose in doing this video. We're focusing on the memorized flashcards, but I would encourage you if you go to beginninggreek.com or deepergreek.com, just note PowerPoints, vocabulary, uh, memory devices, practice exercises, you can download a free graded reader. All of those materials are available for free download.